but yeah i might actually i think i cut my bang too short other than that i kind of like the hair it's pretty thinned out um but yeah i think it looks okay there's my babies but i've never seen this kind of sand it actually is not everywhere like the, gran like everywhere, the everywhere, granules it's, aren't it's kind of everywhere spread everywhere, everywhere really. like the beach sand would be yeah, it will be already on the floor but there's so far there's no sand on the floor if if mommy if if that's if, neat if mommy was here and there was sand on the floor mommy was like clean up, clean up, clean up. <laughs> She would be like, what, Jenny? <laughs> Mommy, that the way she talks. No, she doesn't talk like that, but she'll st still be cleaning. I'm talking about cleaning. if she's cleaning, then she's right. She wants to keep it clean. Yes. Let's see. And the name of it is what? Kinetic yes. Sand. Okay. Yeah. This is worthwhile. How much? How many people have played? Bake Shop. Cookie Dough Scent. Wow. Let's can you bring it over here so we can see what we can make here? Then look. There's so many different oh, things y'all can do with it. Can I have the thing that you made? How about that? A pearl waffle. Mm -hmm. Whoever thought of this, they were they the were very smart to think of this. Very clever to think of this. Mm -hmm. It's soft sand. It sticks to you, but it doesn't stick to you. It's yeah, loose. guys, look. It's like this. See, How it's neat some, is that? See, see, it's like, it's not, it's like this. And then when it gets your hand. Oh, look, like Nettie. Nettie. It. Look it at that. Melts. That looks like a real ice cream cone. And that, like you said, it just melts right all the way from you. Well, but it doesn't go away kind of melt, right? It doesn't melt away. So it just gets like away from cream. your hands. Exactly. It's not like ice cream, guys. So there are different like things you can do not. in here. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. to the mix to the noodle rice mix i promise you you'll love it it's really good y'all i'm telling you it's delicious Section. Yep. It makes your life easier, y'all. Time to tell you. Oh. 
Okay, Woo! I'm trying out this wig. It's one of them $19 specials. Y'all know I have $19 specials in my life. Since my oldest daughter made the first one for me, um, that's what I've been wearing. So, yep. This is what I've been wearing. So I bought, um, I had a gift card, $50 worth, so I bought groceries. And then I think I went over like $5 or something, so... Yep, so now I've already placed my little order. I Well, within those groceries, I actually purchased um, fried chicken wings. What else was it? Oh, I got the the mild. Yeah, the mild wings and the fried chicken wings, the, the drumettes. And I'm, I got my ingredients, the rest of my ingredients for banana pudding which I'm gonna try putting a little cream cheese in. I'm gonna see how that tastes. And now I'm headed to Pizza Hut to pick up the pizza and the Cinnabons. Y'all know me. Y'all know I love me some pizza and Cinnabon, but I'm actually getting that for my son. Yeah. So yeah, yes, that is it. That's really all I came to Wallace to do. Um, this week we're on remote. Um, they don't really want anybody in the building. I did sign up to go in the building Wednesday, however. I might even go in the building Tuesday. It just depends on how well um, things work out with, you know, I've been having a hard time with this wireless, this Wi-Fi in our house. So we'll see. Them upping our gigs did not help. I did call that in. They said, well, let's try open the gig. So I'm getting ready to call them right back tomorrow, Monday, first thing. Let them know that didn't help. So take those extra gigs off because I'm not paying it. That did not help. Y'all need to come out. Instead of sitting in the building trying to fix something, come out. So that's basically the way we're going to we're gonna roll with that. And that's it. But yeah, I might actually, I think I cut my bang too short. Other than that, I kind of like the hair. It's pretty thinned out. Um... But yeah, I think it looks okay. Yeah, I think it I think it actually looks pretty good. Yeah, y'all, but um I have someone in the family on my husband's side who has the coronavirus. She's doing well though. And then the person who's not doing so well, and I think I last talked with him right after Thanksgiving. He's my first cousin. Um he's not doing well at all. Um in fact the doctors don't, you know, they're pretty much giving up on him. But God has the last say so, but also we know that Corona has been um, really affecting lives. And I, when I say affecting lives, I don't mean just making them sick, but, you know, taking lives. And so that's something we just that's have to be prepared for. my New Year's for. resolution. Be prepared for what the days bring. You know, keep it, um, look, look for good, but also in the back of your mind, you need to always be prepared for whatever the day's bring you just never know right but um yes he's had help he's had a couple different health conditions um in the past and this has not made it any better this is probably worse than things for him so yeah i'm praying for him because you know i do know that god is in the miracle working business um as my mother is a prime example of that oh how many years has it been 40 years maybe cancer-free torn through her body she was healed i'm telling you so god is in the healing business but at the same time we all have our day i do believe well, that yes, we all my have my sister our day. is 49 now my sister is my half sister so by my dad um and so i'm excited because she's returning to north carolina my sister is 49 happy birthday Shar! happy birthday i've already sent her a little happy happy birthday message i was so glad to see her when she came by the other day she just made my day i was looking toe up y'all but she made my day the girl is just doing her thing she has five kids they're doing well um i told you about my niece turning 30 and receiving her doctorate so God is good. My oldest daughter is doing fine um, with having been in the accident. My youngest daughter is doing fine. My Y'all do know my youngest daughter was supposed to be married by now. But that's a whole other story. I don't think I've sat down with you all and told you everything. But we'll have that chat one day. We will definitely have that chat one day. Maybe I'll even put her on and 
you know, she can tell you, tell us some stuff. She will not be bad mouthing. She, that is not for her to be bad mouthing her ex fiance. This is just, you know, some things, things that she can see clearer now, not about him, just in general about life. Okay. So that's what it'll be. But yes, let me head on to Pizza Hut and get this pizza and Cinnabon and then I can go back home. Oh, and I did get some salad. So whatever I eat today, this is Sunday dinner. Yes, y'all. Because I fixed, last night I fixed, um, and I know I didn't, I didn't vlog it either. Last night I prepared, um, what did I prepare last night, y'all? I prepared, um, cube steak. Gosh, y'all. I prepared cube steak and, um, gravy and rice and I did the five minute rice, y'all. You can't beat it. Five minute rice. Get on that train. And, um, I added some, what else did I have with it? Cube steak, rice and gravy and a veggie i y'all oh lord please help me remember this stuff but yeah that's what i did but yeah i i keep looking at this burgundy it's kind of a like burgundy highlights i might like, can get with this i like i said i did not do my bang right when i cut it but oh well but yeah let me i will chat with y'all let me get on through here it's getting a little bit dark out i don't know if you can tell here um but my watch says 525. I don't like to be on the road when it's dark and it's time to go. So I'm going to hit on the pizza. Bye.